you have to imagine that I started to work with video in the 70s. And in the 70s, I was surrounded by this discussion, is video art? And can video be art? And all this shit. And, 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 and for me, of course, it's nice now that you're dealing with a new generation. For them, they don't have the same questions anymore. No. If something is art or something is not art, and you have artists, they do everything. They do kind of like a photo, they do a video, they do a painting. That is something which I found already a big treasure mm. of working with an audience. So now you have a generation for them it's clear that everything is fake and reality is fake and everything so they see my work in a completely different way than the generation before because sometimes you're asking yourself why do you have to go with your shit to Peru or to Brazil and what could be interesting for people in Peru or Bogota or whatever in your stuff so it's a fixed show, which one is traveling through un-European countries for the next hundred years. <laughs> I don't know, so. And I'm coming out of a, a father-wise, out of a family, they were refugees. So I always had this question of identity and what does it mean to be German and what does it mean to be not German and stuff like this. This was also always part of my childhood with this weird name I said nobody could pronounce in Germany and stuff like this. Never having a father who was a soldier in the war and stuff like this. I mean, first of all, I do the pieces for myself. So most of the themes have something to do with myself and uh, all the dealing about the Holocaust and, and, and Africa and stuff like this is all family related. So it's also kind of like explaining myself where I'm coming from and who I am. But, um, and I'm using also this kind of like of way of dealing with my traumatas to, to make them livable. The themes I'm working on are global themes mm -hmm. and through this whole globalization I feel the first time that um, I have something to say. So for me of course it's incredibly interesting or great or nice to see that we had in Peru in Lima for example 39,000 visitors mm -hmm. in six weeks. Mm -hmm. It shows to me that my little world is not just my little world, it's maybe also part of a different 